with the commissioner, and she's joining us now uh, with a preview of a good conversation that went on for a while. We did, we did. You know, Dana, we thought it was important to get beyond the sound bites, you know, from the news conferences that we've all heard and seen from Commissioner O'Neill. He said dealing with a homegrown terror attack just hours after becoming commissioner did take him aback for a moment, but he felt in complete control at the scene, due with the advantage of having almost 34 years on the force. He knew everyone on a first name basis, and he was confident this investigation would move quickly. Commissioner O'Neill is described as being a cop's cop, which has its advantages and disadvantages. I understand what it's like to be a New York City cop, and you know, I started out as a transit cop riding the subways back in 1983. Uh, those are experiences that I'll never forget, and I certainly don't forget where I came from. I think it makes it, uh, makes it a little bit easier for them to relate to me, but uh, we just had the, the incident with uh, Deborah Danner, uh, I think it's three weeks ago now, uh, where the sergeant uh, responded to the call and we ended up uh, shooting her. And I came out and I said that that, that was a failure for the police department. And uh, I think uh, the men and women, some of the men and women in the police department took exception to that. But uh, it's my role to protect not only the, uh, uh, the people, of the men and women of the NYPD, but it's my, my role to protect everybody in New York City. And Commissioner O'Neill says that he still stands by those words despite the backlash. Tomorrow at 5, more about his vision for the city. One main initiative, neighborhood policing programs, and also the homelessness, Dana, the curveball that everyone here was thrown of protecting um, the future first family right here in the middle of Manhattan. Unbelievable thing. That must be done and must be done uh, with others collaboratively. Yeah. All in stride. All in stride. <laughs> yes. Thanks, Christine. Look forward to that. You bet.